welcome everyone back to the Witcher 3 the, uh, the hunt and yes I just had a bit of a hiccup anyways where you left off They had boarded a boat and sailed off in an unknown direction. The boat had returned, one passenger on board. A creature as mindless as it was hideous. As mindless as it was hideous. The funny thing is, I mean, that is a human being. <laughs> and how did it end up that way? I don't know. I definitely do know. Maybe a curse. Maybe. Hmm. Nah. Yeah, I don't know. Uh. Well, at least we did, you know, let's say... We did, you know, scare someone. I mean, what's the name again? Jesus, the name of these guys, I mean, they're quite hard to remember unless you have, like, a picture of their ugly face and everything. The Skellige Isles and Hindersfjall. I still forgot it will too. How do I get rid of the fucking... There you go. Right, I think I need to... There you go. Oh. That fucking easy. Ah, oh, lord. I can find a horse and junior. Alright, for the quest, at least. Because I really want to get my... Skill the, uh, let's say... Pump in out of pump, let's say as much as much XP I can out of these things, but whatever. Right, and on the way we go. Run, Roach. Deer. Some dumb deer. Oh shit, yeah. Uh, sorry, you say I uh, kind of say sweet. I mean, change the angle of my mouse, but whatnot. At least, uh, but the bright side is I got myself some proper armrest. The downside is, I mean, I have to get used to this from scratch. And yeah, fuck you, GPS. You cannot, you cannot, you cannot fool me. This might be a bit, a bit of a bad idea, but hey, fuck it. Long sword. Oh, it even drops some loot as well too. Good. <clears throat> All right. At least I've been over there to at least see that at least the uh, this GPS not bullshitty with me. I hope. Actually, it is bullshitty with me. Take me to the wrong side, huh? Maybe unless there is for Ah, fuck it. Oh, sword. Better put it away. Before someone starts complaining about something. Oh, for make up your fucking mind. Whoa there, Roach. Hindertial. <coughs> so, what I got this time? Can I have a word? I serve the goddess and her flock. What can I help you with? What are the horseshoes about? What's with the horseshoes? Those who wish to race in the hero's pursuits hang them there. At a series of races? Can outsiders sign up, or is this a closed event? Freya sees no insiders, no outsiders. Any man can pay her tribute by risking his life in the pursuits. Our races differ from those on the continent. We are beholden to one rule alone. First across the line wins. Oh! The swiftest, 
Other times, it is the one who knocks his opponents off their mounts. Oh. Explains the name. There an entry fee? Courage. If you do not lack it, hang a horseshoe. Ah, fuck it. What's the reward, at least? Winner get a reward of any kind? He covers himself in glory, basks in proof of his valor. Mm -hmm. Was hoping for something a little more tangible. Of course to it us, is. Such things matter least. But yes, the winner receives something to remind him of his feet. At times it is a sword, at others a helmet or a shield. Ooh. How about that? See, you can be practical if you want to. All right, I'll race. Bit of exercise never killed anyone. So, where are the races held? The first three on Ard Scallop. Whoever wins each at least once returns here to Hinduskjall to face last year's best rider in a final pursuit. Gotcha. What's his name? You mean hers. Astrid of Speakerog, known as the Vipers. Lovely as monikers go. And completely deserved. Good luck, would you? May your deeds bring the goddess pleasure. Oh, sure, oh, sure. Cursed. Wonder if he's as strong as he looks. Hmm. I may regret doing this, but fuck it. I mean, got myself for you, some, some good shit going on, so I might as well that. And you bunch of shite. That's way, way better. Sword, shield, or whatever that ca or whatever else it, it may be, right? Well, all in time. All in time, I guess. So, let's say. And a cemetery. How nice. No, not the monster with this bullshit. You like that silver? Yep. Go to where the race starts, they say, huh? I wonder where would that even be? Stupid GPS is just taking me literally anywhere. And never. I knew this thing was bullshitting me! Go dead. And something happened here or what? Eh? Oh. Mm hmm. You're welcome, I guess. Very liber liberated. Sparks, There's a bunch of fish over here. There you go. I am in hunt. Fishing today How are one. Grant me patience, Freya. Greetings, stranger. What's he offering? I'd like to look at your choice of swords. And especially now be able to sell some of these ones I got. Plus 80. Hmm. Or plus 94. 90. 26. Uh, you know what? Mm-hmm. 
Part of me really hates selling on this shit right here. But you know what? At least it's worth every penny, I guess. Doesn't have enough coin. There we go. Of course he has. There we go. See? Way, way better. Watch as you sort of the meaning might have given me like a nice as they travel back down the line. It's a very it's a bit painful, you know, just to let them be sold off like that. Uh Lead. Uh. Hmm. This is a fair trade, I guess. It's got to get tunic. Nuff Guardian. Broke ass motherfucker. Alright. So what I got? I got poison one and what's this? Sign intensity. Hmm. And there's my uh, all the other other shite went. Alright. Mm, even this or two. What else do I need and what else do I don't need, eh? Food and rank. Mm. Jennifer the wrong. Yeah, right. Silver. Hmm. Farewell. Hold on. Jesus Christ. Minus ninety-seven. Mm. There's a lot. Greetings, stranger. Farewell. I'm not that yet, Mong. Sparks, bless them. Ancient hey. rooms in the blade. Oh, for bless fuck's them. sake. Nah. Reading strip. I'd like to look at. Right, right, right. That's one. The silver, silver. Uh, a secondary weapon. The steel. Oh, what? Ooh. I'm taking that one. What else? Hmm? I guess it's about it. Farewell. The organization that keeps around this place over here is essentially zero, but hey. Minus 26. Eh, why not? Hey, dude. Greetings. Here. You slut. Fine. There we go. Alright, that seems about right. Farewell.
What the hell? Whoa there, Roach. Why? Yes, why? Mm. Hey, yeah. I kind of believe I might, I might be better off just doing this by foot. Essentially. Oh, would you look at that? It's nowhere near. The, that's right over here. Ah. Uh, well, the druid's camp it is then. Do you to merchants offer different goods for different prices? Blacksmith? A better price for a sword than a merchant? Eh, maybe. Oh yeah, I mean, some of the things, I mean, it is what it is. I got, got me something over here. Raised a, a druid. Look on well. <laughs> yeah. Fair enough. Some, you know, traveling from point A to point B at times. But hey, whatever. Whatever, right? I mean, if I wonder if, if I really want the best gear to have around, then hey. Then so be it. Glad you're here. We're one short of starting the race. You up for it? Yep. Sure am. Grab a horse. People, we've a third. Join in bold Sigat and Fish Breath of Gear will be Geralt of Rivia. You look at him. Best nurse for me at the top. Faster, faster. Come on now, you piece of shit. Out of the way, gay dog. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Can't you go any faster? Eh, that's an interesting nice uh, race, don't you dig it don't you gray? Come on, you piece of shit. You gotta move on. Give this little bath, you know, plenty of time to relax, but does it, hmm? Come on now, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I almost ran into trouble there. Unless I did. And we'll see what really happens. Alright, so what do we got? It's loading, nonetheless, it's loading. Listen, folk, our winner is Geralt of Rivia. You bathed yourself in honor, Witcher, and earned a beautiful price. I just love the, the wolf mask. <sighs> well, look at that, we got nothing extra.
equipped. Equip is better. Yeah, no, can be better. Oh, the one equip here is way better. Right. So, what do you got ourselves here? You know what? These races and everything I might ignore. Might. So what are we looking at? Got a lot of shit in the map. Oh, look at that. Nothing. Oh, whatever. These sound much better than before, give it that. <clears throat> First off, I think she, I mean, with like a fancy like this, they could uh, actually on this or whatever, right over there. That one's been the one being tracked. You know what, fuck it. Someone, some, some enemies they believe. I mean, they can actually scare me up while I'm under, underwater. Bit of a shame I got my crossbow. A mutagen, used to enhance abilities. Da 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 da. -da. Books provide a, uh, books dedicated to specific monster types provide more information about how to fight them. Oh, I suppose. Oh! I remember last time we know when I overlooted well, how it really ended. There you go. River, don't eat so much. Watch yourself, white hair. Axel, here you go. Axel, the, the axe with the axe. I'm looking for people from Umvik. They're dead. See now, I heard many survived. Stubborn, get your... What do you want to know? You there when the giant attacked? Giant? Aye, I was. One of the Jarl's personal guards. 
Uh, I failed him. Let no credence to what the priestess has said. We'd be punished for robbing the earth of iron, forging it into blades that men kill one another with. The Freya would punish us. Perhaps they spoke the truth. Maybe. Jarl of Undvik, how did he die? Jarl of Undvik, tell me about his death. Jarl Harald the Hound Snout. His whole crew died that night. Wilmar, Wilfred, and Wilhelm. Hurry. I reached them too late. Saw the giant dash Wilmar against a rock. He fell right beside me. All his bones broke, wriggling like a salmon on the sand. Ouch. Harold was dead by then. What? No, Jarl fought like a bear. Slicing and dodging and hollering, then slicing again. Couldn't save himself, though. How did he manage to survive then, hmm? How did you manage to survive? First I heard the giant growl to those flying sirens. Damn me if he weren't giving them orders. Under stress, men see all kinds of things. I know what I saw. Rushed to help the Jarl, but one of the cunts sunk her talons in me, lifting me up. Tried to take me to their nest, pecked me apart, I reckon. But I broke loose of her grip, plummeted from quite a height. Crashed hard, couldn't stand. Last thing I saw, a swarm of sirens swooping down on the yard, thrashing round him. He yipped, he yelped, he screamed, he hollered. Then silence. The men escorting the women and the children to the ships took my unconscious flesh away and brought me to Ard Skelly. And how the hell is he still walking then, huh? He fell from a height, couldn't walk in a few legs. I should go. Yeah. Now uh, one is Axel, yeah. Gallagher. Survivor. Tante. He looks depressed as all hell. I'm looking for men from Hundvik. Yavors from the Isle, and I once cut those waters with nary a race. I could trace you the shoreline in my sleep. A lovely excursion, but not for the bloody sirens. I'm the one to ask. Me or Axel and Tavarok. He's over there. What can a blow from our Skellig know about Umvik? <laughs> he was a different tune when Galmar was gathering his crew. Your love for the Ancret fade that quick. I <laughs> uh, gotta get you, I gotta go. get you Undvik. Need to get to Undvik. Ugh, another thrill seeker. Well then, listen close. Lest you end in a watery grave. Sail out of port and head southwest. Watch for rocks protruding like pricks out of the water. You'll have to do some tricky tackle to get past them. Some of them shorter, just below the surface. So careful not to scrape right over them. They reach your hull, you're done for. Cause just a few minutes in that icy water makes a corpse. One time I remember... Stick to the point. Mm. Hey, oh, fine. Watch for the currents, cause they can drag you off course. Dash against the rocks even. Mm -hmm. With a bit of luck, you'll land on the same beach where Jalmar landed. Why didn't you go with Yalmar? Yalmar's from there, or so he claims. And you seem to know these waters. Why didn't you sail with Yalmar? Because that kind of expedition needs a true leader. And a wet looking to collect bumps on his skull can only be its doom. Once I... You'd rather sit in your arse nose in the air, you Zarakinian princess. Brave lad comes along. You sail with him. I'd have sailed with Yalmar if only those seahorses hadn't banjacked my knee. Would have sailed instead of sharing a table with a grumpy barnacle like you. <laughs> You'd sail with anyone who'd let you aboard. Crack's daughter included. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I made you the sirens will too. You mentioned sirens. Many on Undvik? So, so many. More on the other eyes. Bollocks. Once they attacked Lars and me when we were fishing, before we could drive him off, they pulled Lars in the water and scratched me up so bad that, boy, 
drive away the sirens? How's that work? Ha! Plain to see you're no islander. With a horn wall's horn. One toot, and they plow and scurry off so quick the waves rock your boat. Fair enough. Need to go now. Nice talking to you. By time I was on my way. So long. Fair winds to you. Uh, time to get out of this tavern where people get drunk. And then when you get drunk, they start with your degeneracy. Greetings. I'm Geralt. The Witcher known as the White Wolf, I know. <laughs> I tell stories about you every day around here. Looking for an open seat at the table? I'll be fine. Just wanted to talk. Heard the uh, Yelmar uh, recruited men here. Heard Yalmar came here to gather men for his expedition. Aye, he did. Such spirit. Stormed in, swept the bowls off the table, jumped atop of it and cried, I'm sailing off to seek glory. Who's with me? Who wants to cut off a bloody giant's head? Hmm. Guess that was enough to recruit a longboat full of men. Ah, they carry them out on their shoulders, yelling all the while, we'll win back the forge, string that giant up by his gizzards. Should have seen it, Witcher. Brought tears to my eyes. Should have. Seems like Yarmar's popular around here. Yarmar seems popular around here. He is cracks. Clever lad. Put together a fine crew. Hardy drinkers and warriors both. By the times they have to piece together tables and benches after hosting them. The Unvic lads he took on. No spring minnows either. In fact, was a clan Tordorach man gave Yalmer the idea for the expedition. The shipwright, uh, what's his name? Figgy? That's him. Hope to earn a new by name, the Fearless. Well, now they call him the Loon. <laughs> Imagine the forge, what about it then? They wanted to take back a forge? What's that about? Never heard the Unvickers forge the best armor in these isles. Their swordsmiths are nothing to sneeze at either. Mm. Have they made our blades like the dwarves forged their sails. Soft layered core fitted with a hard steel coating. How do you know? That's a clan Todorok secret. Got some friends who are dwarves. <laughs> <laughs> but the ore from the mines of Undvik, right, not even. Well, no one's got it. That's that. You think? Alright. You must plan. have had a plan. Tell me about it. Plans? Ha! <laughs> they didn't even know where to look for this giant. As oh. I recall, Viggy wanted to cross a frozen lake and scale the mountain. They say the giant came from there, awoken by the frost that gripped the land around the tower. To the harsh winter. Suited that man-eater perfectly. It can only get worse. Even the gods... Well... Hmm. Mm -hmm. Another one don't believe Ragnarok is nigh. You'll see. All of yous. Adorable. So long. Glad to be of service. If you need to know more about Undvik or the giant, ask Axel. Or that one over there. Or Anter. Oh. That was a little invert, but alright. Ah, suck it. I have to go for a drink, but... Eh. At the time, I suppose. You heard the young on Herbalist. Would you like to buy something from Miss Dash? <laughs> sure. Maybe. Let me see what you got. I thought he was a herbalist. Oh, that's me. Crow's eye. Alchemy. Seems about right. What else I got? Uh, about 
This amount. Ten of each, you know, because why the hell not? What else am I missing? I got myself all these things over here and... Eh... What can I say? So long. Not to think about it well too, right? Hanged man's venom. You will never slay an enemy. Time slows for a sure bit of time. Oh. Spectre oil. means hold on oh at least the axelman's boots seem something quite interesting about now but until then oh man I think I might have... No, I have not. Holy shite. Oh, fuck it. Right. Okay. That was quite something. Right the hell, you mong. I'm gonna move on. I'm standing around looking pretty and everything. Oh, it's the other way around. Alright. It's funny now, and you have to drive a boat, even I control the wind and everything. But hey, time for a long travel. Oh, you look at that. Mugglers cash. Yeah. Get the hell out of here. So, so. Yalmar, they say. And of course, I mean, how impossible it would be to... How oh, shall, shall I say... Return to birth. Get to the uh, the water, right? Oh, that's all they say. Cause so far everything seems to be seems to be going so darn easy. And a graveyard of ships must look lovely tonight, I suppose. And shit sinking. Right. So oh, whatever. At least another addition over here. 
And I was told over here that this icy lake over here would kill me. Well, looks like they lied. Uh, getting to this clue over here is going to be quite an adventure. Oh, not your average mist. Might be a fuglet, for all I know. You know what, I mean... Ah, fuck it. Over here, dope. I really want to see about what's with the lighthouse over there. Uh, maybe not be a good idea. Almost managed to find cover. Almost. Hey, anyone there? Uh, how did you get here? What do you think? It is an island. Where'd all those wraiths come from? Last saw something like this near Vergen when... From nowhere. That's just it. Fire went down and wind died of a sudden. That's how it started. Came out here for oil, stepped out of the house, looked up, saw the mist rising. Then the ghost showed. Came straight at me. Bolted it back inside, hosped the door and then I heard it. Someone whispered me name. Miguel, Miguel, I look out, there's the rain, big bugger, bigger than the rest, and cold flowing from it, such cold the windows frosted o'er. I'll help you then. I can try to help. First though, a couple of questions. Ask a hundred if you will. Just get me out of here. Any idea what might have drawn the specters? These ghosts didn't appear without reason. Something brought them here. Any ideas? No clue. There's nothing here. The lighthouse. Me hot just rocks besides. Even bloody drowners know there's nothing for them on Elberg. Mm-hmm. What about this wraith, huh? Tell us more. This wraith. The big one. Tell me more. It is. It seemed more clever than the others. Like it knew. Knew everything. Haven't helped much, have I? Sorry. Only saw it once. It disappeared right after. Strange. Need to look around. Here. This key opens the lighthouse. You know? In case you want to look inside. Or you need to run from something. Unless it's already inside the lighthouse. Eh? If you know what I mean. Got it, fish. I mean, of all the places that I've been to, I mean, this guy over here has quite a bit of a a comfy place. I'm not gonna lie. Or I live you know, in an area such as this one, and a time such as this one, I'd want a house like this. If it was, you know, that I back then. But hey. Alright then. Hold on. Not that you dope. What the hell you done, huh? Let me press the wrong button. Oh dear.
Ah, fuck it. Over here, not gonna show anything, right? I might as well just uh, go ahead at the other uh, thing. Oh, whatever. No oh, shit. Son of a This is one reason why I hate him so much. Oh, great, and I have to climb all this over up again. And I would appreciate if he never done that, but whatever. Oh what fucking ever. Great. Amazing. Put some effort onto it, would ya? Oh, whatever. This piece of shit that pushed me off over here. But he's already dead. Oh, whatever. I'm over here, you ghoul. This with a fucker that pushed me out the cliff, huh? <sighs> Finally. Oh. How are you doing? I did want to the lighthouse, and yes, here I am. At the lighthouse, so now what? Hmm? You have to wait until night time? Let's try that. Midnight's always the best time to expect trouble, I guess. Alright then. Ah, fuck it. Oh. There. I thought at least would be over here. But looks like no, I was wrong. Hey! Why are you running? Why are you running? Piece of shit! Oh, 
behind you, you dope. Oh, but hey, I'm gonna keep swinging the sword around. Otherwise, I mean, I'll be the one being hit by that thing. Ah, oh, that makes more sense now. Sure, I mean, I could go swimming over there, but for one, it would take so much time. Come on now. Here's my hoof, doggy. Here we go, finally, a little too. There we go. Vroom vroom. Quite literally. Cash. Probably the same being circulated by those rays and whatnot. Now these look more like a can of water, man, if I was to swim in it. Ha! <laughs> I would die! Basically, instantly. Mm-hmm, and he wasn't kidding about the other uh, piece of rock that was... Up and down, then you got the raids, and then the smuggler cash. I'm crossing through it, but I don't give a shake. Two. I got a bad thing to do. Get me? Get the hell out of here. I know I could actually cross it over there, but I'm not really gonna risk it. Game saving with good reason. <laughs> for what reason? Explore the ruins of Urxar and search for signs of Yalmar using the Witcher senses. That's how cool the reason the water really is. Oh, look at that, nothing. Or so we think, right? Or so we think. Besides, the wall too, this should uh, essentially have something over here. But nah. Stupid animal, I'm over here! Oh, whatever. I can only wonder what the hell am I to expect over here. Come on, you stupid the horse. There we go. I said, but then jump, but I wouldn't jump. What the wonder why, huh? 
At least a bright set, I mean, in case I ever need. A faster, I gotta wait at least a faster on my way out of here. At least. Ah, uh, yeah. There we go. What I got here? Not the war the hunt at least. Hmm, shit. Minus thirty six. <sighs> Whatever. This is good for go, the coin go. more than more I'd say. It's a bit of order. Lower. What I got here? Mm. And that's the giant. now this is gonna be quite something giant tracks all right could you piece of shit Right, one down. Oh shit. I long, I long to be to the You know, like, use with the, the crossbow, that'd be fucking amazing. But my, 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 uh, oh, this fuck. One down. Boy. Oh, there she is. And my blood's coursing streams. It's time, time, I was home. To the mother's abode, whose corners are wrong. Gotta be this climb, you know, or whatever. You got Octo. Why turn off? Why shut off his lights? Hmm? I know that song. What are you doing here? Look, man. Another one. And so many times I've told him. What's that you say, Wilfred? <laughs> right you are. They never learn. At least this one heard a song before he died. Looking for this... Uh, the giant spare you. What's the giant feed you? Not much game here, but I saw the giant give you food. Where's he get it? Don't know. Don't ask. Food suits me. Suits my crew. Over there, on the ground. Hands got bite marks on it. What? Where? Well, Mark, damn it! You're supposed to clean up. 
couldn't keep a secret if your life depended on it. We had a choice. The Hatter starved to death. And I didn't force anyone. You know, whole crew voted in favor. Alright. Looking for Hjalmar and Crate. I'm looking for Hjalmar on Crate. Word is he came to this isle with a crew, aimed to defeat the giant. Oh, I saw him, as did Wilmar. Sure it was him? Wilmar's got eyes like a hawk. They stood where you stand now. Poor shape they were in. Eat the shoulder. red, fallen, Viggy. Just between you and me, that boy is not quite right in the head. Uh, oh, the young on Crete was here too. When was this? Remember when this was? When what was? When Hyalmar on Crete was here with his men. Oh, that? No, I don't remember. You might ask Wilhelm, though. Where'd he go? They say where they were headed. Did they, Wilmar? Oh, aye. Aim to make camp in the old guard tower. <laughs> Easy enough to find. Stands in the middle of a valley, garden, absolutely nothing. Try to come back for you later. Try to come back for you once I found Yalmar. <laughs> Sound awfully sure you'll find him? Maybe you can kill the giant while you're at it. All on your own. They're the same to a man, aren't they, Wilhelm? All think themselves immortal. Gotta go. So long. Hey, if you really aim to return, mind bring me some solid twine. You're like to find it in the village. And nails. We're short on nails. Can you remember that? Nails and twine. I'll remember. <laughs> I nice. like that silver. And beheaded. A litter, you say, huh? And you went that way. Oh. Old sheepskin. Need to find another way. Ah, everything in its own time, I suppose. Encampment. They were attacked. Fought barefoot. Sirens caught them by surprise. Hmm. Scavengers got to this one. Taken by surprise, but they fought off the attack. I need more clues. Search the perimeter. Two people came through here. Separately. These tracks are older. Somebody left the camp before the attack. I'll get back to that in a bit. Several men. Dragged a boat north. The sword. The sword, you mong. Oh, whatever. I see about the footsteps over here. And then we can see what it really is.
Hmm. Landed smack in a necker's lair and cut the beast down. Hardy folk, these skeletons. Another track. Right. Hmm. Would I mean, you look at that? One arrow in each. Good eye. Hmm. Definitely came through here. Well, that's def that's awfully nice of you to notice it. To this. Someone used this as cover. Went this way. <sighs> Got hit good. Lost a lot of blood. Couldn't have gone much further. Another track. <sighs> Is all this really necessary? What I got here? Lost a lot of blood. Couldn't have gone much further. Oh. Sorry about that. She, she just just kept on getting minimized. And there, there, the fella. Lost a lot of blood. Couldn't have gone much further. What the hell is that over there? Horn wall. All right. Archer finally caught up to him. Oh my! F Archer finally. Where did that Archer go? This isn't in this not Trolls. Dragged him into the cave. Wonder if he's still alive. Why would he even be alive at this point, huh? Archer was wounded too. Probably a pickaxe would be more efficient than this thing over here. Hey, what did that do? Oh, look at that, nothing. There we go. Off he goes. No, 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 you faggot. Ah, you piece of shit. 
Oh yeah, let's go slide. Yeah, let's go slide. Oh no, I'm dead. Very tiresome. Yeah, we know, right? This bastard is. Trolls dragged him into the cave. Why you he's still alive? Archer was wounded too. So, hmm. Cooking something. the man then. If I win, I take him with me. If I lose, I'll jump in the pot too. Good! Good! <laughs> no bubble! Not I swear. Anyway, my no time for riddles. Sake. What the hell are you doing? Rolling around in there. Can you walk? Uh, I, uh, I'll manage. Let's get out of here. You all right? Never go in a sauna again, long as I live. His oh, hands are fucked. I think I'm fine. You saved my life. How can I thank you? 
Mm. I'm looking for Hjalmar. Hjalmar? Curious where he is myself. Him and the whole crew. Something must have happened. Otherwise, he'd have come looking for me after I went missing that night. I know he would have. Wait now. Why are you looking for Yalmar? Would Yalmar... Krach sent me. Krach sent me here to find Yalmar. New king will soon be chosen on Ard Skellig. Everybody's waiting for the young Ankrate's return. So it started already? Yalmar, ruler of all Skellige. Doubt he's cut out for it. Yalmar's irresponsible, stubborn, and heeds no counsel. But he's a born leader. Been mates since we were lads. With him, man, Ceres. Ceres has put forth her claim to the throne as well. Ceres? But she's... Well, she's... She's what, hmm? He's just like your father, Krach. Like father, like daughter. What about Krach? He support her? He let her set off on some daft quest. Wasn't thrilled, especially since Sarah set out without telling him. Nor did she tell me. Where'd she go? Who'd she take with her? Speaker Og, and no one. She went alone? Damn the dogs! If Yalmar only... Has she come back, do you know? Yeah, she's back. Did what she set out to do, too. Thank the gods. I think Yalmar think the Yai Shang was. Any idea where Yalmar thought he might find the giant? We'd learned where it has its lair, in the caves above the village. Yalmar decided the best way there would be to cross the lake. <laughs> Viggy the loon insisted he knew a better way, through the mines. But none of us fancied strolling into a monster pit. How did the, the other got separated? Hmm? How did you get separated from the others? Had to watch for the night. Saw Egnar of Pharaoh steal Yalmar's hornwall horn. The one he uses to drive away sirens. Bugger snuck out of camp. I followed him. No idea what got into that ginger head of his. Told Yalmar not to take him with us a thousand times at least. And? You catch up to him? Aye. In these caves. Bastard screeched so loud he drew the trolls. Thought the buggers would eat me right then. Dropped me in a marinade instead. Decided I was ready to cook today. Would have been the end of me if not for you. Hmm. What about this expedition, more importantly? The expedition. Tell me about it. Started like the best ballads. With a hearty storm. Sail whipped about like a rag. Finally caught sight of shore. But then sirens attacked. As if they'd just been biding their time. But we'd have come through somehow, I know it. If not for the bloody helmsman. What did, uh, his helmsman do? Helmsman made a mistake. I'd say his ma made the mistake. <laughs> or the or something. Dim that one. A piece Heard of shit. Tales and was so afraid of sirens he stuck wax in his ears. Failed to hear our warning calls. Steered us right into the rocks. Oh. Lost a few men. Had to drag the wounded on litters. Oh. And the sirens pestered us the whole while. Yalmar kept blowing his horn, but we'd come too close to the hillside and he brought an avalanche down on us. Eek. Not your lucky day, it seems. What happened next? We found that daft bugger in the ship, then pitched camp near the guard tower. Things seemed to calm. Mm, think I know enough for now. Think I know enough. So long. Wait. I'll go with you. Luckily the trolls didn't use my bow for kindling. Good. <laughs> Let's go. Even a whole lot better than before, though, too, now. Wait. Hmm. He is. I'm mentally wondering if he was still coming along. Oh, all right. 
Ah, I'm glad to see that he still did. Please. Out of here. Quite a bit of a mark over here too, I'd say. Figured I might as well find something over here. Unfortunately this room is as empty as it will get. Nothing. What he got here? Yomar's man fled to death while trying to escape. But what happened to his cohorts? Signs of a battle. No shit. Been here before. Guess you could say I've never been fond of Clan Tortorock. In fact, no one in Arch Skellig is especially fond of them. Mm-hmm. And back is after the. You claim Arch Skelligers don't like the people of Unvik, yet you helped them after the giant attacked. When you see of a drowning man in a storm, do you ask what clan he's from first? <laughs> Point taken, I guess. But your people gave them shelter. And now you've come to kill the giant. Of course we've come. Winning back Unvik's the best way to get those folk off Art Skellig. Fair enough. You can have a good relation with this, to this clan. Any clan out there Art Skelligers are friendly with? Well, certainly wouldn't be those Brockvar cowards. They'll say it ain't so. But a hundred years back there, Jarl walked them off the battlefield just because the enemy showed in greater numbers. And Faro folk are cheats and thieves. Everyone knows it. The Twirsek of Anskellic always been too big for their britches. Now, Madman Lugus's clan. They're all right. Funny. Thought they were your greatest enemies. They are. But we just can't respect the other clans. Interesting. Let's get going. What do you got here? They ran toward the caves. There we go. Someone tripped and fell, but managed to get away. Someone tripped and fell, but managed to get away. Why well, have seen that twice? <sighs> Trust me, sometimes video games can be way better than some Netflix with more accessible to politically to politicized bullshit. Well, this is all game mods and games and whatnot. I don't know. They came through here. You think? Hmm. It's deep enough. Shouldn't hit bottom. I Let's... like that silver. Thanks, imbecile. I think they're alright, but you hag. Oh, there he is. Fair enough. Now to where? Black magic doll, yeah. 
Yeah, that makes sense, alright. Here we go. Should we we'll continue on over here? Clean cut. That probably went flying. Oh, I don't know. Fought to the bitter end. Thorsten. Mm-hmm. Seems like I stumbled quite a bit, quite a bit of few rare metal. This seems. Thorsten, he says. Another Sliced one. Up. Two men, looks like. Rest of the crew went on. Wonder how many were left. Yalmar lost a lot of men here. Arvid on Tordorach. He was dead set on coming with us. Mm. If he says so, right? If he says so. I don't even think about it. Oh, you look at that. Blunt pickaxe. The tunnel caved in. You bastard. Oh, I don't think so. Another harpy dead. So yeah, so there's this beautiful tree over here and everything, but... So what does it really have to do over here? Know the Isle well. I've never been here before, in fact. Alright. Alright, I see everything that needs to be asked, so let's get a move on. Going. Bit of a harpy fuckery over here, but hey. That's taken care of. many arrows too. The one really hated that harpy. Ah fuck it. What? Lost your nerve. Okay. Devour. It looks like a fun place, alright. 
Oh, gods. Near 20 of them. But no Yalmar. That is until... Yeah. Not really a good idea for him to walk in here, but whatever. Ouch. Thanks, asshole. With fingernails of the dead. With fingernails. <sighs> the killer whale potion. Oh. Oh yeah, true, true. Yeah, nice throw. The less lag you can do, the better. Here we go. Show me a pantry and I'll show you the mice. There'd be something more over here, somewhere. somewhere uh, can't be over there here you go lots of old tracks giant must have come through here often Everything looting in here. If it's one thing I learn in games, I mean I save often. Never know whenever shite might hit the fan or whatnot. Giant does climb up the mountains, all right. But no. Oh no. The mini bit didn't do that. Didn't do that. But whatever. If he climb? That'd be amazing. No, he can't. He just slide. Maybe wondering what the hell I'm doing. I don't know. My oh, son of a... Hmm. 
There's quite something over there in the distance. Oh, I swear. How can he slip on that? That's what bothered me the most. At least this one would, be more, would make more sense, but... It doesn't. Close, but not good enough. Where I was about to get that one. I'm about to shoot that one. I'm gonna be able to put a meter so I could actually hit something! Oh yeah, that one, that, it, uh, that definitely got him. Oh my good lord. Got one at least. But how? That one's down. I guess I'm going to move, motherfucker. Got plenty of time. I feel like I walked my mouth sight to fail. Another one down. Fallen! I was sure you died. Where have you been? Ceres has gone to Speakerog. Alone. Couldn't wait. No. Had to sneak off. As if you were afraid of someone would steal the giant out from under you. Ceres? She staked a claim to the throne then? And you'd have rather gone with her! I'd have liked to have the choice. Wait! Still need to thank you, Geralt of Rivia. I'll never forget you came to my aid. Where's the rest of the crew? Where's the rest of your crew? Fought our way through a swarm of sirens to get here. Only a handful of us left after that battle. Now we're but three. The sirens tore Leif up good. We should mm -hmm. see to his wounds. He's dead. What? Nah, he's just unconscious. Lost a bit of blood. He's dead. Trust me. <laughs> bit of a denial, isn't he? I know what he means. Swore he'd sink his blade into the giant's heart. Swore it on the bones of his ancestors. Coming with me? Stupid question. <laughs> Join us, Geralt. And if we got any other choice. Know the Isle well. In fact. Yeah, let's go. Let's kick. Hurry now! Pick up the pace! See you're rare to go. The funny thing is, I mean, we're all doing this on foot. I mean, sure, the little two can actually bring a few horses along, but not. Plow an enormous horse, son, he is.
Now finally decide to climb in or what? Geralt, help me smash that! We're sure to reach the giant's cave this way! I cover you. Oh. Position myself so as to keep the giant in sight. Uh, no time to get that bastard pay, I'd say. Yeah, not with the well. Getting colder. Gotta be close. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. Step and you can wake him. Hey, quick! Let me out before he wakes! He should be around here somewhere. Wait. Know what they call Viggy? The loom. For good reason, too. Best he stay in there till we finish with the giant. What? You out of your bloody mind, Uncrate? I thought he was your comrade. He is. Which is how I know what he's like to do. Let's free him. Let's free him. Giant's pretty big. Looks pretty mean. We could use an extra blade. Even one swung by a madman? I heard that on crit. Let me out right now. Wait here. I'll look for the key. Key hunting. Exactly what I what I know what needed. Mm, you gotta be shitting me. the giant bare fist as soon as he was out. That might have spelled death for us all. Thanks for your help, White Wolf. Geralt the Giant Slayer. Oh. I'll make sure the skull said it in song. Thanks. So be it. Sure sounds better than the Butcher of Blaviken. So be it. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Let's go. I mean, he said he was going to drive the sword into Gotta the giant's heart. To hard, Skellig. Aye. After all, I'm to be crowned. I killed the giant, won back on Vic, and lost my entire crew. Mayhaps should have said that alone. alone. Like Ceres. Ah, regrets ever setting out? Regret ever setting out on this expedition? What's the matter now? Giant's dead, and the folk of Unvik can go home. And Cyrus? She back yet? Yeah, and she did what she set out to do on Speakerog. She always liked competing with me. Except so far, I've always won. So far? Well, time I was on my way. So long, Geralt. Thanks for your help. So long, Uncrate. Ah, 
Geralt. Yeah, planning the voyage. Got another voyage in mind? Of course. Ice Giant was just the beginning. Besides, I got all kinds of horse sons already saying he wasn't that big. <laughs> what about the folk of Umdvik? You and your men were going to help them return to their isle and rebuild Urskar. Cerys will take care of that. <laughs> you and Siri grew up together. You and Siri, as I remember, you two grew up together, at least for a while. Aye, spent half her childhood in the Isles. Always at my heels she was, scrawny wee thing. But her leaps on ice skates, why none of us could rival them. Tried to outdo her once, smashed me mouth on a rock. Ouch. Then you went to Krach and announced you'd agreed to wed. You hear of that? Aye, we had twelve winters on us, both. Any thought of continuing with that romance? Me da whipped it out of me head. <laughs> Wonder what it'd be like to see her now. What the hell are you waiting for? Farewell, on crate. Aye, 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 aye. Hey. Right over here. Fucking blind or what? Last night was oof. Yep. I can relate to that. Master Geralt. A guard spotted you from the tower. They sent me to open the gate. Why was it closed? Is that famous Skellige hospitality? Me. Tis tradition. After the feast, the Jarls will choose the king, so the doors must remain closed. Only the sons and daughters of Skellige may stay in the castle. Hmm. Krach made an exception for me. Krach make an exception just for me? All know what you did for Ceres and Yalmar. Today, you're one of us. Come. Krach awaits. How's the mood in there? Calm. Too calm. How's that? We've an adage here at Skellige. At a good feast, huh. meat and blood flow in equal measure. Surely you consider this barbaric on the continent, no? Not sure. Sounds preferable to dull banquets garnished with court intrigue. Right, but as you do, and I'd expect you to support me, not pinch my allies. If an on crates to wear the crown, it should be you, cause you've got fur growing on your chin, got it? Show some of your own, and the yarls just might listen to you. Get your mug smacked. Remember, I was left standing last time we crossed fists. <laughs> yeah. So you'll fight the bill cards with me. Wonder who'll do better, you or Yalmar, the giant slayer. Politics. Fun stuff, Zero. isn't it? Hey! Ah, damn it! Where's Krach? Don't see Krach. He talking to the Arles? No, went to his chambers. To prepare your promised reward, no doubt. If you've a spell witch, or perhaps you'd fancy some fisticuffs with the Vil cards. <laughs> Loosen up your joints after your journey. Maybe oh. later. Doggy. Yep, one way to get scared after a shite. 
Greetings, Berna. Feast not to your liking. This is no feast. It's a farmer's market where votes are bought and sold like sheepskins. Oh. Leaving Kertrold. Leaving Kertrold. Tomorrow at daybreak. Enjoy yourself, Master Geralt. <sighs> so we see. May I? You must even come. I've been waiting <laughs> for you. So, feast to your liking. Any better than your continental balls? Definitely more to drink. Ah, there is. Rolled all of it out of my cellars. Double meads, triple, Cintrian plum brandy, the Hakamum spirit that burns the mouth like boiling water. Clan on Crate knows the meaning of hospitality. I guess it'll kill your motive to yours. But the reward. Promised me a reward for helping your children. And I aim to keep my word. Here. This bauble's been in the family for generations. I give it to you for helping ensure the line endures. The barbell. Beautiful craftsmanship. Thanks. Looks I'm like the, the one just had. Wow. Fun and feast spoiled by a fucking bear. Come on, then you piece of shit. Come on, you piece of shit. And another one over there in the distance. This not a piece. This piece of shit at least have mind his own fucking business. One last asshole right there in the corner. But I finished this one off. No, I did. Job well done. Well, that lasted pretty short, didn't it? So what? Cloth! Give me some cloth! Gotta stop the bleeding! Quick! Da. Da. Take my cloak! Stupid animal. Hold on, son. He'll pull through. A shark grabbed my leg once. Albion! He's dead. <laughs> Crack! Where'd those bears come from? Huh? Answer! Now! Does it look like you would know? Speak to my dad. Stow your blade, pup, or Crack will lose a son too. You insult me, Lugas, and now you threaten my son. Let's start with this. Dad, come here! Come on! Put you down like a rabbit dog! Calm down, calm down. Enough blood's been spilt. Someone brought these beasts here to murder our sons and brothers. We cannot restore their lives. But? But we can, we must avenge them. This burden falls upon the host and his offspring. Find the guilty on crate. Find and kill them. Else your clan will be cursed for a hundred generations to come. Hmm. Anybody see how the bears got in? Anybody see how the bears got in? Don't matter. I know where to find the guilty already. 
Wait. Wow, he's quick Are you already. mad? You're gonna kill folk before we've learned what happened. Learn all you want. Meantime, I'll go wash the shame off our clan. Hey, the Yards aren't listening anymore. Stop playing the hero and think for a second. Our honor's at stake, sis. I can't wait. Are you listening to me? Someone let those bears in. We must know who, and the answer lies somewhere in this room. Mm. Funny You're thing. Right, Sarah, I'll help you. Thanks. Fine. See you when I return with the trailer's heads. I'll stay here. Someone must see to everything. Someone the healer hand the fallen over to their families. Wolf, I thank you. <laughs> Ever see anything like that? Nope. No, and I hope I never will again. Where'd the bears come from? We were all laughing, eating, drinking. Then those so animals like came in. A massacre. Torrents of blood on the walls. I prefer the massacre be precise. What happened before the massacre? Be precise. Y young Lucas bet he could empty a barrel of beer in one go. He climbed on the table, grabbed a pony keg of centrin wheat, and started chugging. His throat bulged like a blowfish. Oh. Face went red, but he kept drinking. Folks started banging their tankards on the table, shouted, Lugos, Lugos. Then, from the other side of the room, we heard this roar. We turned in unison as if a coxswain had called. They were there. They were already there. Mm -hmm. Folks closest to the bears didn't even manage to draw their weapons. But they, the gates were closed. They were ripped to shreds. We'll avenge them, I promise. Let's look around. We've talked enough. Let's look around. Let me know what you find. I'll speak to the others. Maybe someone saw more than I did. Fang marks, claw marks, broken bones. Hard to say what exactly killed him. Let it go. The gates were shut. Yeah, as I was saying, the gates were shut. All right. What do we have here? Examine head. Bear's head, but the tongue's short, like a human's. What do you mean? Mouth smells of honey liqueur. Mead. And something else. Something earthy. Oh. Bear's like honey. Before it's fermented. Strange. What about the torso? Something under the fur. A tattoo? Shape of a bear paw. Mm, and the limbs. Old scar. Looks like it was sutured. Step away for it for now. Half man, half bear. Something like a lycanthrope. No full moon, so something else caused the transformation. Maybe something he ate. Or drank. drank. Mead. Mead with an earthy aroma. Need to check the horns, tankards, and bowls. Maybe someone did spike the drinks, maybe. And? And what? What the hell are you looking at, hmm? Bowl at each table. Mead in this one. And only mead. What do you got here? Here. Mead spiked with some kind of mushroom. And... human blood. Ceres, come here. A guard saw what happened. Those weren't bears. Those they were people. Men who transformed into bears. bears. Uh-huh. Berserkers. Berserkers. Berserkers? The skull's name for warriors who change into animals in the midst of battle. Oh. The stuff of fairy tales, legends. But it seems to make sense, right? Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, it does. Almost. We were at a feast, not on a battlefield. Got an idea what caused the transformation, at least. I think I know what caused them to transform. The mead they drank. Smell this. Mead spiked with blood. And something else. Thinking it could be a mushroom, but I don't recognize the type. Hjort might help us. Few druids know herbs better. Can't hurt to try. 
F Yort. Well, I already seen this one before, the bear. Someone spiked one of the mead barrels with blood and something else. An herb or a mushroom. Sarah said, give me the horn. Okay, because he ran through it twice. I know the smell. A mushroom. Mardrom. Mardrom. Never heard of it. Mardrom. Never heard of it. You have another name for it on the continent. Silas I believe. All right. Hasn't seen it to soothe pain. Uldorek tried it too, but only a few times. In larger doses, the mushroom causes visions, nightmares. Yes, the last thing Uldorek needed more of. Thanks for your help. Blood and marjoram. The taste of human flesh and a substance that triggers visions. That one could have caused the rage. Maybe even the transformation. Maybe. Hard to believe someone spiked the mead here in the hall, though, in front of all those witnesses. You're right. I had prepared for the feast. I'd have noticed. It might have happened before they brought the drink upstairs. In the cellars, maybe. Come on, we could find some clues there. Perhaps. find the traitors quickly. Elsewise, the warriors will take matters into their own hands. Mm -hmm. Castles have buzz already. Think they'd attack Croc openly? My father or each other. All in the finest Skellige tradition. Haven't had a good civil war in ages. In ages. Knew there'd be trouble. It was all too calm. Fennel. Arnvold said the same. For a feast to be any good, mead's gotta flow. And so does blood. I'd say he got his wish. Or... Yeah. Yeah. I really hope Yalmar's doing something useful, not just looking for a fight. Relax. Your brother's impetuous, not stupid. We keep the poison at the cellar's other end, down below. Come, I'll show you. Right. <coughs> Dangerous right vodka. That's a relief. But what's with all the water over here, too? Here we go. This mead's clean. Whoops. Nothing here either. There. We only went to this one, though. It clean, wasn't it? Blood and mushrooms. Think we can find out where this barrel came from? Looks different. What the? Shit. The spirit! Of course! Ever so easy. We might have been burned alive. Somebody's damn desperate to bring our investigation to a quick end. This is secret passage. One where it is more like when you. When I 
I get my hands on that pyromaniac. That's <laughs> They had to use the entrance we used. Maybe they left some prints behind. Maybe. When the door slammed shut and the fire broke out, did you hear a bottle shatter too? No, but I have no witcher sense at my disposal. You must hear the hair growing on my head. <laughs> I try not to eavesdrop. Anyway, entrance is worth checking. Come on. The sooner the better. I like to look like to a shit, alright? Like that. <laughs> Could you ask for clearer prints? Sticky from the mead. As guilty as a cat in a goldfish bowl. Off. Need to find another clue nearby, something else to follow. Must have felt his clothing rip, but was in a hurry. What's this? Piece of cloth. No, it can't be. What is it? Arnvald's tunic. Only he wears this kind. Sure about that? Saw him in the main hall with the servants. Let's go. And so and so. We'll chase him down. <sighs> Come on. Iron Vault! Stop, damn it! Doubt he'll listen. When I get my hands on him. That's an idea. You uh. don't stand a chance. Way to see you, Bark Dot! Tried to burn me alive, and then he got a lot of people killed. And Sarah's will too. Yeah. Come on, Roach. Oh, that was quick. Slow. Why do you betray them? Talk, or I'll finish what I started. No on crit should ever sit on Skellige's throne. I know you better than others do. You're hot-headed, irresponsible. <coughs> Skelliger needs stability, a strong king. Not the kind a band of drunken Jarls will choose. Curious. Never heard you mm. voice that idea. But I do know one who never stops saying it. It's Bernard Bran, isn't it? You were never a good liar on vault. What was Berna's motive? What was her motive? It's obvious. She schemed this up to get rid of the other claimants. Slander or clan of the process. If she succeeded, Spanriga would have been left. The only claimant to Skellige's throne. We need proof. We need proof. Your word against Berna's, that's not enough. Anvald, help us. And I'll ask my dad to grant you an honorable death. I'll insist. I have letters from her. Instructions. How to poison the lead. But she never signed them. There's no seal. Will that be enough? 
It'll have to be. We shouldn't delay. Hmm. Time to gather the Jarls. A few counts of murder, a bit of a kind of arsonist, arson... Hmm, yeah. That sounds fitting, I'd say. I've assembled the Jarls in council as you demanded, Ceres on Crate. You claim to know who's behind the slaughter at Kaer Trolder. Speak then. The blood of Skellige's sons and daughters. Whose hands does it stain? Boona Brands. The lass is mad. Do you think anyone will believe you? You had them serve poison meat to the berserkers. I beg your pardon. The servants of Kaer Trolda are not mine to command. Oh. It was your father who called for the feast, who assembled the guests. Yes. There's reason in these words. He might have did. Have you any proof to confirm your accusation? I've better. I've a witness. Arnvald. Sarah speaks true. Burner commanded me to poison the maid. When <laughs> Sarah and the Witcher descended into the cellars, you betrayed us. The clan that took you in. Good man. He's a servant to Oncreate, a lackey. He will say what they command him to say. He would lie for them even were he to pay for it with his head. Werner speaks true. Arnvald has served at Kaer Trolder ever since I remember. Loyally, look a dog. There's one piece of evidence. Got one more piece of evidence. A letter from Bernard to Arnvald, instructing him how to spike the mead. <laughs> it lacks my signature. It lacks my seal. But perfume soaked through the parchment. A very strong scent, you know. Still to be sensed. <laughs> Is this your proof, lass? Is this what you call evidence of my supposed treason? Uh. Don't make me laugh. Bernard's right, Cyrus. Is all precious little proof of her wrongdoing. Alas, your brother Hjalmar also has not presented anything that could clear your family's name. We've but one path left to us. Holger, Lugos, it's time we quit this damn castle. Come, we must decide what punishment Clan on Crane will face. You're making a big mistake. You're making a big mistake. Silence, wanderer. <laughs> I've seen snakes with Wait. lesser poison. Mother, you bade me to leave the hall before the feast. Why? Son, not now. <laughs> How did you do it? How did you know? Hi! We stand silent. You gave Ceres no credence. Gave the Witcher no credence. But you must give credence to a son who accuses his own mother. Doing. She shamed herself, me, the family, the clan. Swan Rigget, I did it for you. Only for you. <laughs> you admit to this deed. <laughs> Liar. As the eldest of the Jarls, I cleanse the name of Clan on Creep. And you, Berna Bran, I sentence to death. <laughs> You will be chained to a rock to perish of hunger and thirst, and sea fowl will peck apart your remains. Oh dear. I want you look at that. When I had a lust for power, I knew this. But so strong as to commit such a crime. What about Svanriga? What's his fate? He'll lose his home, his name, his honor. He'll choose exile or death. But enough. Whatever comes, we must endure. I thank you, Geralt. Again. No need. Again. I'll not take any more of this modesty. This is a land of heroes. Let this remind you of that. And now. 
I must ride for Gedinath, for the Jarl's council. Time to pick a king. What do you think? Who'll get the nod? Come with me. See for yourself. All may listen to our deliberations. Ah, <sighs> fuck it. Why not? I do have a horse in the race. I can't refuse, to be honest. As I thought. Well, let's go. <laughs> So and so. We're just in time. They've already started. another in my place. I thank those who stood at my side. Here, beneath the sacred oak, I pledge to be a good queen to the ones and the others. I want peace and prosperity to reign in Skellige. And I count on you to help me fulfill that dream. Sarah! 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 <laughs> Someone was a little salty. A kingmaker. And what do you got to sell us here? A druid. <sighs> Fine, what do you want? As she did with some others, I know. See, one of us, again, went mute on his own. No spell or potion helps him. But it is said strong emotions and experiences can't restore speech. So, I thought perhaps you might. I'll pay you, of course. They give you an excellent Gwent card. Gwent. <sighs> Fuck it. Suppose I could try. I wouldn't even know where to start. You want me to scare him? Aye, good, good. That should do it. Scare, irritate. Whatever you wish, provided you do him no harm. You can usually find a gate near the hollow dog. He's probably praying in his heart for a cure. Alright. Wait a moment. Alright. Ten parts. 
stand to make a lot of noise. Maybe give him a smack once he's asleep. All right. Maybe he'll say something if I put out his fire. Damn it, Gerald. They ever try to cure you some other way? Give you potions or herbs? Hm, not just mute. Seems he's deaf, too. Hm. Hm, doesn't look like we'll figure much out. Talk talking won't get me anywhere. Right. What the fuck? Even that did nothing. Out. There you go. God damn it. Maybe that could have counted on something, but have it. No, it has not. When do you lose your voice? Can you show me? Hold up some fingers. Figure my job talking. So long. Think you're working over here? That's a puzzle that we could deal with about or whatnot, but good Christ! Hungry. Tough 
that's kind of a big visual too. Sticking up a few fingers, he says. <laughs> Fire's one. Might want to just make him blind as well too, right? Well, look at like that. Didn't even didn't even affect him. When did you lose your voice? Can you show me? Hold up some fingers. <laughs> Sort of death of me, can you give him the bird? Alright. Hmm, doesn't. <laughs> Alright, at least, at least, uh, that's something. Bullshit. I know that the uh, the bees over here, but they're not really doing anything. Why? There's nothing over here. I think I can see new toys at least I could sell. Huh, death from above. Nothing to tell me what to do with these things over here. I'm trying to see different different things. The arrow, right? That'd be something, but it work. No, it has not. Not even that works. Okay. Hmm. 
nothing. <laughs> Jump. Hmm. Doesn't look like we'll figure much. What would really work, eh? Nope, nothing. Just waiting for him to sleep. I said, let's wait this motherfucker bring us all sleep. Tricked. Oh, sorry. Someone tricked me, I thought. Boo hoo hoo! My deepest sympathies! Now get out of my sight, you imbecile! being played for I think that druid have some sense of huh. don't like being played for a fool remember that the next time you'll be the one left speechless <sighs> oh 
Horsen efter horsen, eh? That's why. Ah, fuck it. What I got. Bugger. Oh, don't stupid animal. Who is he? Kind old geezer I just saw you talking to. Who was he? One of our circle. Gremist. An exceptional alchemist. But a stubborn mean ass. Well, been around sorceress is my share. Long enough to know that with great enlightenment comes even greater arrogance. But sorceress is welcome apprentices, am I right? Not Gremist. So many formula in that head. So many methods of ingesting and absorbing lethal toxins. But he'd rather take them to the grave than share. Think he share them with me? Maybe he'll make an exception. Share them with me. As likely as mistletoe sprouting from right here. <laughs> Food a grand lady leaves it with me. Wanna talk to you. But I do not wish to speak. Leave. You distress me. I want to teach me alchemy. I want you to share your knowledge. Teach me alchemy. <laughs> My apprentice? <laughs> That's rich. While you're at it, why did you ask Uderic if he'll share Spickerog with you? I'm serious. Ouch. If you think I'll simply betray to you what I learned through years of sacrifice and toil, then you're mistaken. Deeply. Promise to be a good student. I'd be a good student. Doubtful. You can't even grasp the simple notion that I want you to leave. Hmm. The way I'm preparing to perform a rather tricky ritual. So I could use some help. I require three favors. Do them for me, and I shall accept you as my apprentice. Well, well, there's a way after all. Get off your high horse and listen. First, you must bring me a pimpernel from the school forest. Second, I need a bottle of spirit from the distillery on Hale Hill. Finally, convince Fridtjof to help me perform the rite. He's a druid like I am. You'll find him near Blangara. I believe he's there on a matter of some import. So, what will it be? <sighs> Fuck it, I'll do it. Alright, I'll do it. But this ritual you want to perform, what's that about? If you wish to be my apprentice, you must stop asking questions. I decide what to tell you and what to do it. Now go. Chop chop! Before I change my mind. How far away am I?
Here we go. Let's go. Suddenly a new quest. One thing at a time, I'd say. One thing at a time. Some red eyes. Holy shit. The Gremist wants to see you. Gremist wanted me to summon you. Need you to help him perform a ritual. A ritual? Will this one stop him from being a mean old goat? I would go see him. For old time's sake, but I have more important matters on my mind. <sighs> Look about you. The ground. See how dry it is. It's not rained for weeks. The grass and pastures is withered. Sheep are starving. I must bring rain. But fear them. Wait just a moment. Perhaps you could help me. How? I'm a man of many talents, but manipulating the weather is not one of them. I have in mind a different skill involving your soul. You see, Mother Nature dislikes it when you take something from her by force. She will defend herself so fiercely, in fact, that I could use a defender myself. What do you say? What I, what I say is that I want a pet dog with red eyes. That looks so fucking angy. <laughs> sure, I'll help. Provided you go see Grenist afterwards. Agreed. Now follow me. Time for a little storm. Ah, uh, it's a wolf. You know what I find funny? Animal sacrifice. I know. Should we burn folk at the stake as they do on the continent? Better a sacrifice of goats and sheep. Whoa there, Roach. No fun along? Good. And I'm good to begin here. But you know what I find funny about that dog with red eyes? It looked a lot like a German Shepherd. Of course, I mean, it's much less, so let's say. Haha, ah, fuck you, drawners. be praised. Let's go! But of course I mean much more savage. You gotta tell you some wild wolfo. Wild white wolfo. Seeker of Pimpernel. Another. Gremist has sent countless young druids into the forest. They emerge drained, with a blank stare, and with no flower. And they never speak of what happened. I've asked Gremist to stop the folly. He looked at me and laughed. But the fun is over. One of our novices, Ramond, has failed to return. I've come to find him, alive or dead. Listen, you're looking for a druid, I'm looking for a flower. Let's go in together. Why not? I could use the help of a tracker. Lead the way. Flower. No petals. Hoofprints. 
for the bipeds. Biped? Flower. And petals. There were flowers here as well, but they've been picked. Every last one. Ah, and I think I've seen there. Someone buried him. Not skillfully, but with great care. Lots of scratches. None look lethal, though. Bodies dried out as if it was drained. I knew him. It's Yara the White of Care Trolder. He died far from home. What a grotesque creature. Fuck this. Ah, you son of a bitch. this thing shit this thing is there Shit. God fucking damn it Piece of shit I even be surprised at this point, huh? experience was it not hmm? so 
And we got ourselves here. Footprints. Some fresh, others faded. All leading in the same direction. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, no. Oh, stop. Please. Ha-ha. <laughs> oh, this is great. No, no. Stop. Please. What the fuck is going on? Stop it, that tickles. <laughs> oh. Nosy, aren't you? Wait and see. Yeah. A succubus. That's exactly why. And for fuck's sake, why can't you know NVIDIA Shadow Play just work when I hit the key? Or save this all for some awkward moment, I'll tell you that. Oh well. Because you know, it's the, the only the main problem is, you know, it's YouTube. Just don't stare at her. Oh, at least she got her bottoms covered. That's one thing. But not the tops. And YouTube doesn't allow all that kind of stuff. That uh, stuff doesn't get in the fly, I tell you that. Pretty, don't you think? Bellflowers, violets, king cups, pimpernels. I must pick some edelweiss. Huh. Take one, but no more. I've put a lot of work into making this cabin cozy. Sure, sure. She only said one, not the entire thing, you dope. Alright. Well, at least you know, like, the little guy over there is gonna have some fun time with the... the second bus, I can see. But, oh, whatever. Wind's howling. No shit, Sherlock, it is. Pray a smile upon you. Hmm. Oh, it is just now. Fuck you, Wolfo. What's this offer? Got a contract for me? Might do. If you're willing to partner with me. Usually work alone. Could pay to make an exception this time. It's not every day you get a chance to work with the most renowned bounty hunter north of the Yaruga. Jenga Fred himself. I'll bite. What's the famous Jenga Fred need a witcher for? I'm guessing you're a man of the world. Perhaps you've come across the Crossbark brothers in your travels. You hunting them? Aye, quite the rogues they are. Three of them. And everyone's got a pack of rapes and murders under his belt. He even took the grave robin lately. Easy to recognize on account of the yellow caps they wear. Folks see three yellow tops, they flee to their huts. Which don't help much, of course, because they're also fond of arson. No, haven't met him. If you do, tread careful. They're quick to stick a knife in a man's gut. Often just by way of reading. Doubt they'd try that with a witcher. <laughs> Never know what that lot. Right, well I head south soon. Haven't looked there yet. Fare you well. We might meet again someday. 
It's a tale of Grossbart Brothers. So I see. a storm that fine for ages. Did you see the drops? The size of eggs. A little busy tending to the foglets. They weren't small either. Ah yes, unfortunately they always emerge. But perhaps that's for the best. Hmm. Go to the Gremis now? Will you go see Gremis now? With pleasure. After a storm of those proportions, I shall gladly have it to help him with his ritual. Till then. Okay. Rebly. <laughs> Anything else I'm missing? I really don't know. Run off. The more you stop running your wall, the better. Hey, yeah. Giddy up, Beeler. Banditi. Oi. He has an arrow to his head, oh, he's not dead. That doesn't matter. They all died. Small blade.
That's Let's okay. Go. Woofo. Away. I'll ghoul. I'll get that in my eyes. Shit, Ed. Bye. An entrance, but an entrance to what, right? What the hell? Another giant down. Cyclops won't bother me anymore. I can look around peacefully now. Distilling recipes. Parchment's a little faded, but legible. All right. Making some bit of moonshine now. Beast come around again. Nothing could ever go wrong, right? Got lucky. Bit of mash left. Or so he thinks. Here 
here's where the mash goes, probably. Done. Okay. Now to boil the mash. Should have boiled it on the, the first second, but whatever. Ought to be enough. Time to cool it down. There. Dealing rare goods, including mysterious. Da, 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 da. Okay. And of course. Ah! Right. Did everything you asked. Phenomenal, my boy! So, Fritjof, shall we begin? The sooner the better. We've a long night ahead of us. The ritual is only for members of the inner circle. Thus, my dear apprentice, you must wait outside. Under no circumstances must you enter. We shall begin your chiglitch come morn. As you wish, master. As you wish, master. Ha! <laughs> we'll make someone out of you yet, which are. Now off you get! Shoot! <laughs> Wait till the next day, sure. And how fitting as well too the um, the moment as well too. There we go. Essentially just two days gone by. Uh, uh, we must have another. That's good stuff. Aye, as the base from Moose Gordon. And spare from Hale Hell. Good times, Fritz off. <laughs> good times. Finally, something other than damn potions and transitions. Guess the ritual's not over yet. Gerd, I thought I told you to sh stay outside. Only dreads in the inner circle. Sharkle Smirkle, let the boy have some fun. He's earned it. <laughs> Fine. Pour yourselves on. Gerd, let the lessons begin. Drink hard and study hard. I like the idea. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I call it stimulation and assimilation. First you stimulate, and then <laughs> you assimilate a shutdown. <laughs> right. Let's start with ingesting toxins. Best approach, practice makes perfect. Mm -hmm. I've practiced a lot already. Good thing. I'll make learning my secret method. Sure. Look, you take the potion like this, and go. Hmm. Who said old age is a burden? Hey, <laughs> <laughs> okay, they're freaking alcoholic. 
So that's you know the all the alchemy lessons were about drinking. <laughs> okay. Just one more. I'm over here, hoofed all your hoof doors. That's it, Roach. Leathery leaves. Where the hell am I? <laughs> Quite a visual, don't you agree? Quite a visual. Until the harpies came to shit all over it. Get in. Come on now. Okay. What the fuck just happened? Okay, he's fixed now. I think. as much as he wants because he knows he's gonna be next to kiss me sword. Ashamed to hear it. Pull yourself together, man. 
Worst case, Henrikel with ye a wooden leg. Old Ola's got one, and you don't hear him complaining. Old Ola's also got lice, stinks, and leaks out of both ends. Yet he don't complain about that either. You two gonna help or no? How'd you fall? How'd you fall? We set out to light a fire there. Atop of the statue's shoulders. For our own glory and that of our ancestors. Well, Looks like you that. Hey, but the fire won't big so quick Peter jumped back. Lost his balance. Got lucky anyway. Could have broken his neck falling from that height. Got some medicine. This celandine should help you. Won't mend your leg, but it will make it hurt less. Thank yes. killer. Our undying gratitude that gets you. The gratitude of a dying man in my case. <laughs> Enjoy it while it lasts. Shut it and show me that leg. Thanks again. God's guide ye. Time for blood. Actually, wrong sword. But that's what you're not. Broken, the first thing I do is just kill them all. <laughs> Arby's got their nest here. Well, had their nests. Graveyard. I uh, sure suppose. Blood. Well, all right. Whoa. What you needed. These uh, other things are just information for the most part, but hey. All in due time, I'd say. All in due time. Missing a leg. Any water from that? Eh, interesting. Right, 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 right. So, uh, probably some more wolfo. Oh. Probably. But hey, I mean, what's bad, I mean, than to kill some bandits? Something weak, vulnerable, um, or very common, and so easy to kill. And in vast quantities of wool, too. Plenty much to slaughter with a, with a, with a steel sword. Uh, well, not just any steel, but not just any steel sword. A cold steel sword.
<sighs> right. Where am I even going? Woofo. You missed it, you missed it, you dope. Be dumb motherfuckers. Yeah, you, you stupid dog. Hey, Horson. <laughs> the family blade. There we go. What your posts are deadly to ordinary folk. I can only remember I can only imagine. The Empire of Nilfgaard has already conquered many kingdoms and has strived to expand and is currently waging its third major war against the Northern Realm. Martin needs worries like a boat needs power. See my plan? Okay. Reverse that. Don't eat so much. Why the spit up? Because they get hit my gut which hurts. Respect, witchy. I haven't really thought about that. These continental dandies come as something then we gotta drag their corpses out. Oh, shit. Out of curiosity as well, too. Oh, well. Not too late to surrender. Surrender? What's that? There you go. So oh, whatever. Yep, just take the road ahead. Is it? God, your Kulu 
back the sword. Retrieve the property you lost. Kill you? Thanks be to Freya, where'd you find it? Northern part of the Isle, near the Whale Cemetery. Don't ask me how it got there, long story. At any rate, don't need to worry about the thieves. They won't steal ever again. Oh, this guy is uh, no quite determined. Sure as hell earned it. And a lot a bit more from myself. If Kill you had not been found, I'd have had to wash the shame away with my own blood. Fair enough. Hmm. <laughs> oh. These are Axelman boots. How fitting. Fair enough, what's... Oh. Oh, well, all right. Give me a bit of a moment. I got four points available. So might as well just use them wisely. Alchemy. Bomb damage. And combat fire. Plus 50, huh? Where is, uh... There you go. I'd say I got at least a slot for something else. It's a good thing. Rage management. <laughs> mm hmm. Be another one there, all set. Ah, that's what it was. Another one, all good. Good, very, very good indeed. Now that I'm level 20, I should be able to do myself, myself a lot of damage for the time being, right? But, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this one as much as I did, and look forward to the next one. So I'll see you guys next time, and until then!